So do you have a, you said you had a rant this week? I don't have a rant. I do have a story. Well, I guess I could go off on a rant. Okay, you want to introduce uh, it? You want to start our new segment, Mike's <laughs> Rant? Go ahead. I, oh, I should, I, should I start with Mike? Wait, wait, we got to introduce it. Mike's Rant. He's bad. <laughs> Listen up. <laughs> well, you guys, I'll let you guys choose. <laughs> Between... <laughs> It's your floor for five minutes, so whatever you want. But uh, should I should I turn into grammar Nazi again? There's no time limit. Go. Do you want grammar Nazi, or do you want to go? What you, happened you, to the Tate brothers? You, you have the floor. Whatever you want to rant about. Okay, I'm going to go back back to the grammar Nazi stuff. I've I've expressed myself plenty of times. People, when people say words that end in CT, for instance, like project, it's not project. It's project. Okay, that's one. Then there's no X sound in expresso, especially escape. There's no X in those words. Stop using it. It's escape, espresso, especially. But the new one that I got now, the other thing is when people overuse words. Like I think back in the late 90s, early 2000s, basically was a big word. Every other word is basically what it is, is basically, basically this, right? Or honestly, honestly, honestly like, please don't lie to me, right? The new one is at work, adjudicate. So I think it means to make a formal judgment on okay. X, Y, Z. And if you don't use adjudicate at least three times a day, then you're obviously not part of the cool crowd now. So adjudicate is the word of the year. Learn how to use it. it it's never, I need somebody to make a decision on this. It's, um, well, I, I've presented this document and I need somebody to adjudicate it. Stop using it. Doesn't make you sound smarter. It makes you just sound like you're using a word to sound smart. Anyway. Um, end of rant. I think that's it. It wasn't angry enough probably this week, but and that's Mike's rant. So, yeah, you want to see me get angry, or we could talk politics later. So, do you think we should kick in and adjudicate his rant? Yeah. Shut your whore mouth. <laughs> so I got a topic though. I actually haven't heard that. I haven't heard anybody use that. No, because, it's only. I mean, in the I know MDA. the word obviously. It's only amongst. Government and government contractors and things that adjudicate. Stop using it. It drives me fucking yeah, crazy. That does. It's every other word. I hear it five yeah. times a day. It is especially uh God, shut up with that shit, too. <laughs> and when you were working on that project, it was especially. Uh, yeah, you, should, you just can't escape that. <laughs> I think I've heard that pronouncing Stop. words correctly is a form of uh, white uh, supremacy. Mike, <laughs> that wouldn't surprise I've me this that. day and age. Oh my god! Formal education, anything to do with that? Well, no, because it leads to a lot of other bullshit. Maybe the rant's not over. It is not. We're butchering the fucking language. All right, we got cis. We've got all this other like the uh, you know zemzer bullshit. We're gonna they them being used incorrectly in sentencing. We're butchering our language for no freaking reason. It's stupid. And it makes you sound unintelligent anyway. Not eight, that I sound intelligent, but I'm just saying. You remember when eight wasn't a word and then it got added? Hate? Ain't. A-I-N. Oh, ain't. Yeah, another one. Yeah. I mean, but we now, all use it. It is now a word, though. It was added. Well, you know, like words that start with a K, like, like knowledge or cano or knife. <laughs> the K was actually pronounced. You know, it, it, was, a lie. it was a soft key. You know, look it up. It, it was actually pronounced like, you know, where 1600, whatever. I, I, I don't know the time. But period, it was but, hard to pronounce. So they decided to start well, leaving it, it out. It was, it was a soft key. Knowledge. I mean, it, that that's how it was actually pronounced. All right. I, got, I Folks, I'm going to do some research on this. I'll get back to you. Well, on over, it. I don't believe this. Over time, the, the key got dropped you know it's just the way we spoke you know like like english does not sound like you you heard of old e english right mm -hmm. like like you know uh um uh, the it, it, it is, it is put out the 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 and all that you know. all right let me ask you this because this seems to be a point of well e english language is change. it when you when you when you have an do you have an aunt or do you have an aunt 
I've heard it both ways. Well, in the lower 48, yeah. What do they say in Hawaii? Aunt. Auntie. Auntie. Okay. Should be I'll aunt. Say, yeah. Well, no, and my wife will say aunt too, but my dad says aunt. I say cunt. <laughs> and so my dad, whenever my wife says aunt, my dad corrects her. Says aunt. She's like, we say aunt. Yeah, it goes both ways, I guess. It's like a... Uh, I pronounce it forbidden love. Okay, is it data or data? I've heard it both ways. Yeah. I, I think I use that interchangeably. I don't think yeah. I, I pronounce it one If you're watching Star other. Trek, it's data. I don't say database. I'll usually, usually say database. I'll say data center. But How about the... Uh, the 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 uh, graphics file, GIF. How do you pronounce that? I just say GIF. GIF. Yeah. yeah. It's not peanut butter. <laughs> it's not. Yeah. It's not GIF because it would. It be was his yeah, you, 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 So I've heard this argument on how it's supposed to be pronounced, and people will say GIF. It's a GIF file, but it stands for uh, graphical interface file. Graph. So it's a hard G. So it's GIF. Kind of like easy e, <laughs> yeah. a hard G. No, but if, if you're gonna pronounce the acronym, <laughs> and iced tea, yeah, with the uh, hey, ice and a hip hop and you cube. don't stop and up in it. Ice cube in the iced tea. Ice cube in the iced tea. Two shaw rib. <laughs> nah, Tupac Shakur. Tupac Shakur. No, but so I, I've, heard, I've heard this argument. It's like it's not a gif. It's a gif. I'm like, do you know what it fucking stands for? So if you understand the acronym, it, it is GIF. You pr you would pronounce it GIF. Yeah, if you're, pr you're pronouncing the G the same way as and the they whole still, word. And they still would argue with me. That's because you're not pronouncing the K at the beginning of it. Knif? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Kagif. Kagif? Kagraphical. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and yeah, then they'll, they'll, whatever. They'll, you know, they, it, 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 because they're, they're the ones getting technical with me. And when I correct them, they don't like it. You know, it's like it's not GIF. They're not going to be taught. That's because English by a isn't Hawaiian. even your first language. How are you going to tell them about their language? I know. Yeah, I know. I won't be talked down to by a Hawaiian. Who am I <laughs> to, to, to explain the English language? Shoots, bro. Shoots, bro. Lose money. Lose money. Anyway, so I'll delete that one. <laughs> I'm off my rant.